Okay, so let's see how to remove a hard drive from uh, an HP Touch Smart 320. It's one of those with the touch screen, so you can just touch it and it works like a mouse. Uh, first thing you will have to do is to realize that this is a whole all-in-one. So the hard drive, you can't really uh, like open the side of a computer and take the hard drive out, but you will have to take it apart. And um, it's very easy, and I'm going to show you how. Uh, basically, you want to flip the computer on its back, like this. Now, what you want to do, there's two screws here. One is here, and the other one is on the other side. Yeah, there's just two. And you basically unscrew the first one until you feel that it's not screwing anymore. You unscrew the second one. Okay, now... You take it from the back like this, and you just pry it open, and then it just opens like this. You keep pulling until the whole back comes off. Now, if you take a look at here, um, this is a pretty complex, um, it's pretty different from a, a regular computer. But what you have to notice is this box here, okay? This box is the hard drive. And there is one screw down here. And this is the screw that we have to take out. And that basically opens that box. And inside the box is the hard drive. Oh, this is a long screw. Oh. Have to give it a couple more turns. A couple more. Wow, this is a really long screw. It also has a little spring on it and basically um, this guy here slides out like this okay so you take this handle and you slide there's also the arrow here so that can help you and this is your hard drive here uh, you don't have to send uh, you don't have to take it out of this um, case this metal case you can just send it in like this no problems um, you could take it out of this case, you have to unscrew these four screws here on the side and then they take the hard drive out, it's not necessary. When you get your replacement hard drive, you put it inside the case, you, you go exactly backwards. Now, notice that to go backwards, these little um, guides have to slide inside these holes. So what you want to do you want to put it up there until you feel it's inside the holes and then you pull exactly in the opposite direction and uh, your hard drive is basically in place and ready and you just screw the screw back and uh, you're all set.